and hello YouTube, this is GS Math Smart, and I'm going to a brand new video for tutorials of GS. Now today's tutorial, I'm teaching you something in GIMP that's very commonly used, and it's very practical. Um, it's moving multiple layers at once. Now this is particularly important when you're in the middle of editing, you don't want to merge things down. Uh, for example, if you're creating a logo here that I have here, um, let's just perfectionize this. Now say this is your logo right here. We have our D and G, a DNA, not D, not D and G, DNA here. Now, um, say we don't want to, now obviously you could merge down like this. You could merge down like this and then you could move the entire layer around, right? But say we don't want to merge down, say we still want to do some editing to, to these text layers and we don't want to we don't want to merge it down yet. What you can do is you can uh, check mark the box next to the um, little eyeball here, which is actually called the lock pixels panel. If you go ahead and mark the layers that you want to move all together, you can then select one of these layers that are marked and you can move the entire thing around. So it's a nice practical little thing that you can, you can do instead of instead of merging it down or instead of moving each layer one by one because you move it one by one then you know you have to adjust it correctly again and stuff like that so you can just use the lock pixels panel and then you can move everything at once so just a quick little tutorial that i thought would be helpful for anyone who is looking for a way to move multiple layers at once because it is something that i was looking for for a long time especially when i'm doing my when i'm doing my um when I'm doing my thumbnails, sometimes I'll have things that are like really long like like this, that are long like that, and then I have to move both my um, highlight layer and I have to move my main layer. You know, I don't want to be moving both of them and then trying to align it up perfectly. You know, I could merge it down, but then, you know, I, I cannot edit anymore. So instead, I just use a lock the lock tools the lock panels right here and then I can easily move it and center align it again while still having my highlight layer here on top of it because if I don't have this then obviously I'm only moving this one so hopefully I helped you guys so just a quick little tutorial that I wanted to share with you guys and um, I'm gonna be making many more game tutorials I have plenty of other game tutorials as well that there should be an annotation and also a card right now on the screen right now. So hopefully you enjoyed those as well as you enjoyed these. And, you know, hopefully this video helped you out for anyone who's been looking for a way to move multiple layers. Thank you for watching and I hope this video helped you out in any way. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. It'll really help me out. If you didn't like it, you can leave a comment as well, giving some feedback. If you have any other comments or questions, please leave them in the comments as well. And I'll do my best to answer them. I usually respond to comments within 24 to 48 hours, depending on your question and depending on how busy I am. I have plenty of other content on my channel about different software tutorials and how-to videos. So if you're interested in that type of stuff, check it out. And if you like what you're seeing, you can subscribe too. Really appreciate it. You can also check out my other channels and social media as shown on the screen right now. And with that, thank you so much, everyone. And this is GS Smart, and I'll be back sooner than you think. Don't go anywhere.